Radio is coming. The new name for Radio City. And the home of Leanne and Joel. From April 17th, ask your smart speaker to... Play... Hits Radio Liverpool. Looking to get car or van insurance? Double quick. Go, go, go! To mustard.co.uk With top insurance providers, a five-minute pit stop with us could get you out in front in the race to savings. Car or van, work or play. Compare insurance with mustard.co.uk T's and C's apply. Authorised and regulated by the Financial Conduct Authority. Sarah Jane looking after you till 1am. I've got Julie on the way and some Nelly Furtado. But right now at midnight, let's get your latest news update. Hits Radio is coming to Liverpool and the North West. The new name for Radio City. The top stories this hour. The government's plan to gradually phase out smoking and clamp down on youth vaping is a step closer to becoming law. It's passed its first test in the Commons. But some Tories rebelled. Former Prime Minister Liz Truss calls it virtue signalling. But Shadow Health Secretary Wes Streeting says Labour's only too happy to back it. This is a lethal addiction, a scourge on society, an enormous burden on our NHS, a drag on our economy, and it is time to consign it to the dustbins of history. Rishi Sunak's had a phone call with his Israeli counterpart following the weekend's attack by Iran, urging him it's a moment for calm heads to prevail. Benjamin Netanyahu and his war cabinet's weighing up a response. The US says it will impose more sanctions on Tehran in the coming days. A pupil who lost her legal challenge against her school's ban on prayer rituals says she stayed true to herself by bringing the case. A judge ruled that the Michaela Community School in North London was not discriminatory in its decision to outlaw the practice. But Ashfaq Chowdhury is from the Association of Muslim Schools. Unfortunately, our Muslim children are at a disadvantage with the provision and the number of schools that are available. And on top of that, why should our society be banning things? Are we in Putin's Russia at the moment? We are in modern 21st century Britain. Two people have been arrested over the death of a man in West Yorkshire. Police were called to what they describe as a serious ongoing incident in Bradford just before 4pm. A man and woman are being questioned. The House of Lords has inflicted four more defeats on the government's Rwanda bill. It means the plan to send asylum seekers on a one-way ticket returns to the Commons but is still set to become law this week. And Rory McIlroy has dismissed reports he's about to join the lucrative Live Golf Tour. City AM had claimed the Northern Irishman has signed a £680 million deal with the Saudi-backed organisation. He says it's a rubbish rumour. From Sky News, I'm Nick Qureshi. Million pound make me a winner. Win your share of a million pounds. Make me a winner. Oh, do you know what? Yesterday was gorgeous. Yesterday was absolutely stunning as we gave our winner life-changing cash. Maria is off to Argentina as a result of raking it in. But you could win £90,000 today as we play yet another game of the £1 million Make Me A Winner. You could win your share of a million quid. Yes, £90,000 to play for today. Let me tell you how you do it. And considering... We're in our winning era. I think now is the time for you to get involved. Wednesday, the 17th of April. It's a very special day. Right, here's how you enter. Text the word WIN to 63103. Text to £2 plus your standard network rate. You can enter on our website. Online entries cost £2. Or you can always call us on 0330 880 4541 and calls a charge at the standard rate. You've got to be over 18 and all the rules for this network competition are online. Now, if you get a call from us from 3 p.m., Today, because remember we're playing today, answer within five rings and say, make me a winner straight away. Those are the first four words that have to come out of your mouth to win £90,000. Text the word WIN to 63103 for your chance to win every penny. Best of luck. 